Hey folks, it's Bobby and my tooth is chipped again. This one lasted me four months and that's a, that's pretty good, you know, seeing as I could just throw it in again. So before I put this tooth in, let's go through a few things. I brushed my teeth very well before I did this. You need to make sure that there is no bacteria or anything on the surface of your tooth where you will be bonding because it can cause a cavity underneath your bond and you don't want that to get infected under there and you not know it and lose a tooth, have an infection, it's just a bad thing. It's very important. Clean your teeth very well before you do this. Second, I get this kit off, kit off eBay. It's called the Prime Dent Chemical Cure Composite Resin Based Dental Restorative Material Radio Pack Type 1 and it's by Prime Dental. Um, it doesn't need a light, you need to get this kit. This is the kit, no other kit. Okay? And this is what's gonna fix your chip tooth. Alright, so inside the kit, you're gonna have uh, this is a catalyst, this is the etchant. Now, I did the etchant before the video, okay? But what I'm gonna do with this would be just drip it on my tooth and I left it on for five minutes because that's gonna create a rough surface for the bonding material. When I apply it on my tooth, it's just gonna stick onto there, okay? So while we're at it, you need the bonding material. I'm almost out actually, I need to get a new a new pack, it's my first pack. There's so many servings in there. All right, I have a toothpick just for, uh, you know, you know, if I need it, okay? If I need it, a mirror, tongue suppressor, little stick to pull the putty out of here. It comes with the, with the kit. All right, I got a Revlon file in case I wanna file the bonding of the tooth. A buffer and I've got the catalyst right here so let's get to start bonding um, you never know how long they're gonna last sometimes they last like a couple hours you go and you eat and it falls out and you're like dang but then you just go and put one in and that's you know usually they last about four months for me okay so you know, people people love to ask that question, but I don't know how good you are at doing it. I I don't know, you know, what kind of chip you have, if it's big, small, I just don't know what you're doing. So keep on trying. The more you do it, the better you get. I promise this is a professional kit. It will last a long time if you do it right. Okay, so now we start bonding. I've cleaned my teeth. I have very little material, so I gotta fix this chip right here, okay? So I pull equal parts of each putty out, each one of these equal parts. Okay, and then I take those equal parts, I got one and I bond them together and I make sure that I roll them together, okay? I mean, you wanna roll those things together, okay? Now I'm not using gloves or anything. Uh, sometimes I do get things inside the here, but gloves are very uncomfortable for me and I don't like using them and I don't know, I, I do it better without them, so. I just pull out, if I see anything going to here, I pull it out. You really mix this up to where it's, you know, one ball and it's mixed up. Okay, so mine's mixing up. Okay, I'm going to come right here. I like to just press it and smear it. Now you want to pull it under your 
too, so it kind of wraps under and around. Don't be afraid to use your tongue, okay? Okay, here. Let me get this out. Now this stuff is already starting to dry. Once you start mixing it well, it starts a chemical reaction that uh, starts it drying. Okay. So here, let's get this one again. What is that? Yeah. Okay, I like that. Now, don't get too much on the back of your tooth. Bite down and make sure that you can bite down. It's very important because it's hard to get it back off the back of your tooth, but you just use like a metal pick and just pick it off if it does happen. So, all right, so I close out the cases right here. Okay. Bonding material, and I'm just gonna apply some catalyst. Now I want to make sure my teeth are dry when I do this. Alright, I'm smoothing out the back of my tooth real quick, my tongue. A little bit of the putties back there. Alright, so now I'm gonna apply this catalyst to my tooth. Oh, that was a little too much. Right, oh well. And then I let it just run over the tooth. I try not to get it in my mouth. If it does, you know, it's not gonna hurt or anything like that. I... All right, just let it sit. Okay. You can use this, the tongue. Eh, I got it in my mouth. Got it. Smooth out the front with with the catalyst. When you do it, you'll see what I'm talking about. All right, should be starting to dry right now, and and it should almost be done. Again, I'm keeping my tooth. <laughs> I'm trying to keep my tooth dry. Sometimes I, my focus gets out of attention and I forget to do it, but it's not too bad at this point. There it is. It's dry. So, you know, I eat chips. I do it all. You know, I don't let anything bother me. I just do it because I know... Um, you know, in the case of it does come out, I can go put another one in, but this one lasts me for months, and that's awesome for just like a $1.50 fix, and you get to do it in your house, and you don't have to leave or anything like that, so hopefully this helps you out, and if it did, please like and subscribe. I do get paid by Google AdSense. I don't get paid by Prime Dental. I don't work for them or anything like that, but... Google AdSense does pay me for subscribes and people viewing it, so the amount of times you view it and stuff like that helps me out. And if you like it, that all helps me out. So thank you very much, and I hope you guys have a good day. Bye.